Well, our correspondent Emilia Papadopoulos is at the scene. Emilia, what's, what's happening? What's the latest situation? Well, Gavin, this is essentially go, has gone on for more than 48 hours, and this police cordon is now 300 <coughs> metres uh, long, blocking off all the surrounding area. As you mentioned, there 80 uh, residents have been evacuated. We've been told by Ealing Council that elderly and vulnerable people were moved into B&Bs last night and other residents uh, have made their own arrangements for accommodation. Now, the police were initially called here in the early hours of Friday morning. If you look just behind me, the house in question is just over this roundabout and to the left on a street that we believe uh, is Lancaster Road. There are two armed uh, police vehicles and armed officers that are continuing uh, to patrol the area. Now, last night we saw a second night of negotiations and police initially came here because there were reports uh, of a man with hazardous materials inside the property. We didn't know what those hazardous materials were, but we uh, now know from the police that they believe uh, these include uh, large quantities of petrol and also combustible uh, materials.